guys, what's going on? James here, and in this video today, we're going to be talking about how the Tampa Bay Buccaneers have signed safety Keanu O'Neal to a one-year contract. It's important to make that distinction, safety Keanu O'Neal, because formerly of the Atlanta Falcons, formerly of the Dallas Cowboys, Keanu O'Neal played safety throughout his entire time with the Falcons, went to free agency, signed with the Dallas Cowboys, where he actually played linebacker for a little bit for them but this offseason Keanu O'Neal made it known that he wanted to switch back to the safety position which he knew well and loved well and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers are going to give him that opportunity to play safety for them on a one year deal this is one of those moves I talked about right before the NFL draft there is still plenty of moves to be made for the Bucks, this Keanu Neal signing just being one of them. And I think it's a great signing, right? I think this is a very, very solid signing. It puts an end to any talks of Tyron Matthew potentially joining the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. I think that that is pretty much done at this point, considering the Bucks have added both Logan Ryan and Keanu Neal to their safety room. And Man, oh man, it has not been that much time since Keanu Neal was regarded as one of the best safeties in the league, one of the top young and upcoming safeties in the league before he went, joined the Dallas Cowboys, played linebacker for them, and is now back playing safety with the Bucks. I'm really pumped about this signing. Keanu O'Neal gives you a lot of what Jordan Whitehead was giving you, right? An incredibly hard-hitting safety who's got good coverage ability, very good in run defense as well, just an all-around really, really good safety. It's going to be really, really interesting to see what the heck happens with the Buccaneers' safety room because now you've got Antoine Winfield Jr., who you assume is going to be one of the starting safeties, and then after that, you've got Mike Edwards versus Keanu O'Neal now versus Logan Ryan for that other starting safety spot. That is an incredible group of guys, in my opinion. Antoine Winfield Jr., Mike Edwards, Keanu O'Neal, Logan Ryan that's a good safety room that adds a lot of depth, a lot of veteran leadership, and is just overall, now you could consider a strong point of this Buccaneers defense. The versatility as well is insane. Keanu Neal just showed that he can play linebacker. He can play safety. Logan Ryan has shown that he can play slot corner. He can play safety. The, the flexibility of some of the guys that the Buccaneers have added in that safety room this offseason has been fantastic. Keanu Neal being the latest guy on that list. We don't have the amount that Keanu Neal is going to get paid yet on that one-year deal. Once we do, I will be posting it down in the pinned comment down in the comment section below. You would assume Keanu Neal is possibly a strong favorite to get that other starting safety position opposite Antoine Winfield Jr. if he is able to showcase the abilities that he had when he was playing safety with the Atlanta Falcons. And yeah, this is a really, really good and kind of unexpected signing in my opinion. But another former Falcon, a former Dallas Cowboy, joins the Tampa Bay Buccaneers defense and is in is what is now a pretty darn loaded safety room with all the guys that got in there. Keanu Neal being the newest guy added, possibly being brought in to be the starter next to a guy like Antoine Winfield Jr. What do you guys think about the or the signing of Keanu Neal? What do you think he's going to be bringing to the Buccaneers defense? I would love to hear your guys' thoughts and opinions on this. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next video or the next live stream. But until then, and as always, guys, goodbye for now, and go Bucks.